this episode of Create Consumer Pete, I revisit the OG Xbox in glorious 480p, 720p, and 1080i via HDMI with the help of Comeric's HDMI Video Adapter. So stick around. With the release of the Xbox Series S and X right around the corner, I decided to go back to where it all began, the OG Xbox, Microsoft's first foray into the game console market. This massive black box right here would not only change the game industry forever by including a hard drive and ethernet port in every single machine, it would further drive the concept of online console gaming first seen on the Dreamcast, which let's be honest, they helped Sega develop. But what good is a game console without games? And here again, the original Xbox delivered. It not only introduced us to new characters and worlds, it pushed the limits of what could be achieved on a game console. From kicking the shit out of the Covenant, performing barrel rolls in an alternate 1930s America, slicing heads off of rival ninjas, or fully immersing you in the Star Wars universe, the Xbox shook up the industry and carved out a spot in the ultra-competitive game console market, not to mention my nerd heart. With a game library of a thousand games, the Xbox had something for everyone. And to this day, it's my favorite game console. But sadly, trying to play these classics on a modern TV presents challenges. Originally released with your standard composite video cables, hooking up the Xbox to a modern television to take advantage of its ability to output a progressive scan signal and digital audio requires you to get your hands on the official Xbox Advanced AV Pack, which, well, it can be pretty goddamn difficult since they're no longer made. And if you do manage to find one, you're also going to need high quality component cables and a TV with, you guessed it, component inputs, which is getting harder and harder every day. Of course, this isn't the only option when trying to get those glorious OG Xbox visuals on a modern television. For the truly hardcore, you could pick up an open source scan converter, but that is a pretty big investment that I would only recommend you pick up if you're a big retro gamer and plan to use it with different game consoles. Regardless, whichever option you prefer, they both require a decent amount of effort to hook up. And let's be honest, no one should have to go through that much trouble to play a game. Thankfully, a company named Kumeric felt the same way and decided to release an adapter that not only allows you to easily connect your OG Xbox to a TV via HDMI and pump out a crystal clear progressive scan signal in 480p, 720p, or 1080i, you can also opt for the optional Toslink port to take full advantage of your sweet, sweet digital audio setup, which I don't own. Now, to prove that there is no post-production YouTube fuckery going on here, this is Burnout 3. And I'm gonna play it, and it's gonna be in 480p widescreen, as it should be. So as you can see right out of the gate, it's already in widescreen. And yes, it's only in 480p, but it's amazing looking. Crystal clear, super sharp, the way Burnout 3 was meant to be played. I mean, look at this. Woo, almost crashed. And for those of you out there that are counting pixels, keep in mind this is a 480p signal, uprest to 4K, then uploaded and compressed on YouTube. I can assure you the picture quality on your set will make your jaw drop. Still not convinced? Here's X-Men Legends in 1080i. There it is, look at it. Just like you remember when you were a kid. And let's be honest, the X-Men have never looked better. Hell, my comic book loving nerd heart might just explode from sheer excitement. Now, before you run out and order one of these, please keep in mind that while every game will look better, not all games take full advantage of 720p and 1080i resolutions, since that's dependent on the game itself. And if we're really getting technical, well, not many games take advantage of that or the 16 by nine aspect ratio. So please check which games in your library support these alternate view modes, or you can just click the link in the description below. With all that out of the way, let me address the elephant in the room. There are those of you 
out there that are probably saying, why buy this when you can play your OG Xbox games in higher resolutions with updated graphics on the newer consoles? And well, the answer is pretty damn simple. You can't play the full library on the newer consoles. Not to mention, I'm a purist that believes game preservation is essential to the art form of gaming. From riding dragons, cleansing the souls of the undead, saving a princess by rewinding time, running clandestine black ops, or rebuilding a world from scattered memories, the Chimeric HDMI adapter presented me the best version of each Xbox game I own, while still remaining true to the developer's original vision. And that's pretty damn amazing. So how much does all this amazingness cost, you ask? Well, you'll be surprised to hear that it only goes for 50 bucks, which is pretty much a steal. And at this point, I should mention that I am not paid to endorse this product, nor am I sponsored by Chimeric. I'm just a nerdy guy in New York City that has a deep, deep love for the OG Xbox. That'll do it for this episode. And if you love retro gaming, check out my other videos on the Analog Super NT or Mega SG. But most importantly, don't forget to smash that like and subscribe button. And if you really wanna know when I drop a new episode, hit the bell. See you guys next episode.